Our live Team 2 coverage of the Trayvon Martin shooting continues with a rally here in Metro Atlanta. Hundreds gathered outside Providence Missionary Baptist Church in Southwest Atlanta tonight and also called for the immediate arrest of George Zimmerman. Channel 2's Tony Thomas there now live at the church. This crowd here was probably three, four hundred people strong at its height. One common theme as I walk through the crowd, people saying what happened in Florida could easily happen here. Something seriously needs to be done because we can only take so much pain before we give it out. Anger and sorrow mixed together in this hour and a half Atlanta rally. All of us are just like Trayvon. Sorrow for Trayvon Martin's death. Anger at the neighborhood watchman who says he fired in self defense. A punk, coward, murderer. What do you want? Justice! What do you want? Now! Near the back of the crowd, amid the signs, I find Sonia Jones, a Douglasville mother of her own 18 year old, also named Trevon. He wears hoodies. He's, you know, from a nice neighborhood. No, it's not a black or white issue. It's a people issue. It's a justice issue. But many speakers here did link the Florida shooting to racism. Tying the Martin case into local incidents where police have shot young black men. Racism is alive and well in the U.S., and we have to fight this. Vito McCoy fights it by the words on his shirt. Am I next to, to be killed for no reason? A question these Georgians say they won't let rest. I am Trayvon! I am Trayvon! We are Trayvon! We are Trayvon! He's Florida, son! And quite a bit of time at this Atlanta rally was spent giving people information, contact information, how to call prosecutors and police in Florida and the Department of Justice in Washington. Live in Southwest Atlanta, Tony Thomas, Channel 2 Action News, Nightbeat.